Three men were found stranded, exhausted, and dehydrated in the waters near Rangwana Key over the weekend. A search and rescue operation was conducted by the Belize Coast Guard, BCG, which led them to a Belizean, a German, and a U.S. national near an area referred to as Third Reef. According to the patrol commander of the BCG, Chief Rigoberto Rivas, five officers were deployed and they initially encountered a vacant, partially submerged vessel. This prompted a search within a five nautical mile radius around the vessel. The vessel encountered engine problems. 68 was choppy and upon um, finding them, they were tired. They were in distress. Like I said, immediately after when we um, approach them, we provide medical care to them, we immediately give them water, give them something sweet for them to get back their energy and um, make sure that the three of them are um, in good health. And we, after that, we did departed to Rangwana where um, everything was um, already in place for them so they can be um, attended, no? The sinking boat was secured to prevent further submersion. Officers gave the three men candy and water to build back their energy so they can be safely transported back to land. Three personnel were found in the area called the Third Reef. Immediately after which, the Coast Guard, my team, provided emergency care to each individual and um, tried to assist them in any way we can. We, I ended up to find out that one of them were, uh, was diabetic. That would be Mr. Leos, um, 18 years of age. He's a German descent. Chief Rivas says that it is not uncommon to encounter mechanical problems at sea. However, the time of day it occurs and weather and sea conditions can influence the efficiency of their search. He further highlighted that it is imperative for seafarers to make sure that their equipment is up to acceptable standards before heading into the waters. Mechanical fuel on vessels in one engine vessel that can always equip to anyone. However, the position that it was and the location where it was is by Rangwana area where all fishermen go and do fly fishing. And, and as you can see, well, bad, bad weather was coming into the country of Belize and the sea was a little bit choppy. I did from, from the tour guide this day, he had engine failure and he didn't want to talk about the situation more, much in depth. Um, at that time, what I, um, my, my first reaction was to see it live at sea looking, looking for them and make sure that we find them before night because if night settles down, it's going to be worse. Reporting for Love News, Giovanna Mogel.